Hey guys, welcome back for another video of Fiat Destroyer. I'm excited about this unboxing today. This is a long awaited package. I don't know, probably a month or so at least. Wait, maybe it's more like two or three weeks. I don't know, but it feels like a really long time. And this is actually a private deal from Facebook. Many of you know that I do like my Facebook deals. So, and most of them have been with just one person but I've always made out really well and I already opened it up did not really take a look inside I did peek inside and remembered one of the things I bought but I don't even remember everything that's in here and this is the fourth package inside all of the other packages that it came in but yes this was one that um, well I don't usually check my tracking numbers but with all the stuff going on recently then I ended up doing that but I was not able to find any information for a long time and then all of a sudden it just showed up in my mailbox. So that's great and it looks like we have everything here in one baggie and as you can see we've got the color of gold shining so that's exciting. So all right so it looks like we have a one tenth ounce maple and I didn't even know about that. So. <laughs> Uh, let's go ahead and get into this. I didn't know about this. This is a tube of uh, silver eagles. And looks like we got some random stuff there. So, there we go. Okay. So, I believe I won an auction for a one tenth ounce gold. And I thought it was going to be a philharmonic. But it looks like they sent me a maple leaf. And that's fine with me. I know these guys have a little bit of trouble keeping track of their stuff sometimes. But this is indeed my first ever gold maple of any kind. And it is very, very beautiful. Many of you already know about that. And I can see why you guys are such big fans of the gold maples. I know Yankee has... A whole tube, 20 of the quarter ounce maples. And as far as the year, looks like this is 1997. A little bit of an older version of the Queen there. Really nice, nice shape. It's in a blister pack. I think I'll just let it in there to protect it. And then we've got here a tube of silver eagles. So that also is pretty exciting. And I can't really tell if the camera is focused or not. I think it is. Alright, so now I'm guessing these are 2020s, but I actually have no idea. So I'm just going to crack this open and take a look. I should be able to twist the top here if I get it just right. Mm, I don't know. Sometimes, sometimes these are easier than other times. Or if there's packing material, that can make it difficult too. But sometimes you can just take this and twist it doesn't seem like this one wants to go. I don't really have anything to grab a hold of, so I'm going to have to use a knife to get into it. It's actually pretty easy if you have a pocket knife. If you've never done this, you can usually get your blade right in between that lid and the container, and it just pops open really easily like that. Okay, so let's take a look at what we got here. And yeah, it looks like it's 2014. So I'm guessing the whole tube is 2014 I think it's a solid date roll but maybe I'll pop out a couple I don't really feel like touching them if they're in decent condition right now let's see we've got one out of there looks one's 2014 as well so I'm gonna guess that the whole tube is 2014 and that's fine I don't really care what the uh, the year is but I'll go ahead and pop this right back on there and this is going to go in my monster box. There we go. Got that gap out of there. Always found it funny that there's just a, like a little bit of play in a tube of eagles. But I guess that's okay. Yeah. Well, that's exciting. 20 more silver eagles for the monster box. And in case you didn't know, a monster box holds 25 tubes. So 500 eagles, or 500 ounces of silver in total. And 
I don't, I'm not sure exactly how many eagles I have, but I know I'm over halfway in the monster box. And I would like to get that done. Hopefully can get that done within another year or two. But we will just keep on stacking. I know I got a lot more eagles this year than I was planning on. But of course I wasn't planning on all the crazy stuff happening that it did. So I know my goal was to stack um, three tombs or 60 silver eagles. And I probably did more than twice that. So... All right, well that's that, and we did the the maple there. So let's go ahead and see what else we have, and then maybe before I end the video, of course we'll update our hundred pieces of gold paper, and I will also check and see what else um, I was supposed to get, or if I got everything. I mean, looks like we got more gold. Here is a year of the snake bar. Pretty interesting. Looks like it's just a uh, generic silver, not a coin of any kind. You can see the Chinese characters there. 2013, it's got some age on it, it's almost 10 years old, not quite. I guess uh, 8 years old basically. So just a generic ounce of silver there. And then here we've got. Let's see, 1964, 1964. I believe this was um, a little bit of 90% silver to cover a mistake that was made in a previous order. So we've got here a dollar twenty-five face value there. I think that was correct. And we've got here another piece of gold. And I don't even, I did not even remember this piece, guys. But it is a dose pesos and. Yeah, it's a 1945. So I've been showing these off recently. In fact, my last video was of two of these guys, so I don't have to show that off in detail. But yeah, two more pieces of gold. Wow. All right. So I'm just going to take a quick minute or second to check on my order and just make sure I got everything that I was supposed to. And I'll be right back to update our 100 pieces of gold paper. Alrighty guys, so I've updated my paper here, and for those of you that saw my video very recently, then you know I was at 68 pieces of gold, so now with two more I'm up to 70, so I got to another uh, 10 marker there, I'm in the 70s now, and I actually have more than that, I know of two other pieces just in the back of my mind that are still coming in the mail, hopefully they will arrive, but yeah, that's uh, 70 pieces of gold on our track record here now and it brings us up almost to another um, half ounce so well I mean not between these two pieces but we're almost at the nine and a half ounce mark um, yeah it's just kind of cool to watch that number slowly rise and we've got a new piece of gold this is exciting I always enjoy getting something that's new whether it's silver or gold if it's anything new, I just really appreciate it. And I've been looking forward to having something gold and Canadian, especially like gold maple, for a really long time. So this is great. And yes, if I forgot to mention, I did check my order and everything checks out. Everything is correct except for this piece right here. I did actually pay for a Philharmonic, but I got a maple instead. And I'm not even going to um, talk to them about it because it's the same amount of weight in gold and I really couldn't care too much whether one went one way or the other. And so unless he um, asked me about it, then, then I'll consider it to uh, be normal because in the past there's been a few things like that where if they don't have exactly what... Um, they thought they did or whatever, um, he'll just send me something else equivalent or better in return. So that's it guys, two more pieces of gold for the 100 pieces of gold challenge. Um, yeah, it's going pretty fast. I, I almost wish I was going a little bit slower, but on the other hand, we still have another 30 pieces of gold to go and that does sound like a lot. So. Um, yeah, I don't know. I actually don't really know for sure if I will finish the challenge 
in 2021. Um, I've got to add quite a few pieces this year, but we will see you guys. So, yeah, well, I'm really excited about all of these pickups today. Let me know what you guys think of these. And if you are a gold stacker, let me know what is your bread and butter. Really be curious to hear about what is your bread and butter when it comes to to gold. Haven't really heard a whole lot of thought about that. I know there's a lot of different things that people like. But anyway, guys, time to go. Remember to keep on stacking that silver. Silver Eagles, remember to keep on stacking the gold. And keep on destroying that fiat.